on the wall. Who's the fairest of them all? Oh, hello, I'm Marie. Did you know the reason we're able to see ourselves in the mirror is because light is reflected off its surface and into our eyes? When light hits an object, it can't pass through. It bounces off or reflects. Today, we are going to reflect the light off of our smartphones to create a hologram. Here is what you'll need to do this experiment. A working smartphone, a smooth transparent plastic CD case, a cutter or pen knife, a ruler, a pencil, clear tape, and a piece of paper. Draw a trapezium on a piece of paper and cut it out. Trace the paper trapezium on the CD case and carefully cut out four shapes. Try not to scratch the surfaces. Smooth surfaces allow light to reflect at the same angle as it hits the surface, producing a clearer image. This is called specular reflection. If the plastic surface is rough due to scratches or dust, the reflected light is scattered in different directions, producing a less clear image. This is called diffuse reflection. Now assemble the four pieces together like this. Use tape or glue to hold it together. Put it over a video playing on your smartphone and watch the image come to life in the middle. Behold your very own hologram. There are several videos online that are made specially for this hologram experiment. There's a link to some of them in the description below. Or you could create your very own. Let's see what creative holograms you can conjure on your phones. As my favorite scientist Marie Curie once said, nothing in life is to be feared, it is only to be understood. Don't let fear keep you from exploring. See you next time. To watch more, subscribe to our YouTube channel.